Okay, so what I'm going to try to do now is show you guys how to lay down some paint, alright? Like we've established before, what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be picking up some darker value paint and just laying it down in a stroke, alright? I will do this in, in different areas because my goal is not to do this, you know, not to just do this whole thing right here, alright? I'm going to be developing a patchwork of different strokes. and so. Right here, let's say this this value is not solid black. This would be more like, a, if I were looking at a 10 step value scale, this might be more of an eight or something like this. Put some right here, maybe put a mark right there. And then I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna get a, diff a different color, okay? Because my goal here is to not paint everything monochrome. I'm gonna be coming back and making a patchwork of different colors, okay? So that's what that's what our ultimate goal is. We can always go back later and paint over top of it as well. All right? And right now, I want you to know that especially in the beginning, we're just establishing a base. My goal is going to be to paint from not just the background to the foreground with this, but right now, I'm just going to start laying down some values. I know that I can always go back later and paint over top of things, even if it's still wet. It's fine. So... What I'm going to do now, I'm going to take a little bit of this darker, let's take some of this black mixture with the blue-green, and I'm just going to check it up here. It looks kind of like this value right here, okay? I'm going to lay that down, and I'm going to leave it, okay? And now what I'm going to do, I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to get some of the red mixed with the black I have right here, and I'm going to lay that down. You guys see that? That might be a bit dark, so it's okay. What I can do, I can just bring up some of my red from over here, mix it with that. There, there will be palette mixing. You just guys, you guys aren't mixing it on the actual surface. And so now, look at that. Okay. And now that I have enough on my brush, I might come over here and also make a little swipe right there. Okay. While I have it on my brush. Making a few different places. And now I'm going to go back with a completely different color. I might go over there with some of the, the dark value mixed with the orange. And you notice it's kind of a green. You say, whoa, aren't these complementary colors? Yeah. But for right now, for what we're doing, it's going to work. Okay? So I'm going to update this in a few seconds. Let me paint for a few minutes and I'll come back to this, okay? Okay.